Hi guys, welcome back. So I think I have another dupe for you, an affordable one. So I was going crazy looking for the new, um, what is it, a prismatic highlighter from Revlon, their Skin Lights collection. And I got one, not the one I wanted, but I was like, let me grab this one so I can review it and give it a shot. Oh, oops. I think I dropped enough stuff already in my video, so let's not break this one. So this one is in the shade Twilight Gleam, right? So that's it. It's really pretty. That's gorgeous. Um, and I was looking at it and I was like, wow, that's really pretty. I'm like, it reminds me of something. And then it hit me. It reminds me of the Bobbi Brown Bronze Glow. This one's used a little bit. So, and it's funny because it has like the embossed texture and everything. So I just want to show you guys side by side. This one's slightly, it's like slightly a little bit more golden, I guess. And this one's definitely more bronzy, but they're pretty close. Um, they're pretty close in color. It's crazy. So I'm going to swatch it on this hand. First, I'm going to swatch the Revlon Twilight Gleam and I'm going to like load up my finger. See? Uh, so that's my ring finger. I'm going to load up the bronze glow on my middle finger. So we can compare it like that first. The textures are very similar. So, Revlon, Bobbi Brown, $11.99, about $45. Okay. I'm going to swatch the Revlon, Revlon one first. So that's the Revlon. It's got a pretty sheen to it. Next to it, I'm going to swatch the Bobbi one. Ready? Again, really beautiful sheen. Super close in um, shade match. The difference is very subtle. I almost feel like the Revlon one has, um, it's just, like I said, it's a little bit more golden. And between the both, I almost feel like that would actually work better for my skin tone than the bronze glow. So now we're going to put one on one side of my face and one on the other. Now, to be fair, I'm going to use the same brush. This is the P75, the Wet n Wild one. And then this was like from a holiday collection one. It's the same, it's the same brush. So we are going to do one on one side, one on the other side for color, for texture. And you guys let me know what you guys think, because as of right now, they're pretty close. It's like a slight difference in undertone. All right. So let's go on with Bobby on my left side. And I'm just going to pick that up. So that's the Bobby one. This brush is going down. Now I'm going to pick up the other brush and I'm going to go on Revlon on this side. Again, just going to pick it up. It's so funny, they like pick up the exact same on both brushes. What do you guys think? That's really pretty. This one I can't see because I'm like at the wrong angle. Hold on. Uh, now, is it me or does the Revlon one seem more like, I don't know, like more pronounced, more glowy? Maybe it's my, I don't know if it's my angle because I have a mirror here to look at my light. What do you guys think? I really like the Revlon better. That's just being honest. And like I said, one is $11.99 or $10.99, depending where you get it. And the other one is $45. So if you were thinking about getting the Bobby one, I would say check this one out first. Now, if you're more on the tan side, um, the Bobby one you may like more, but uh, I know on Amazon, they're coming out with a third shade. 
which I didn't see at uh, Harmon's or anything like that or what I'm seeing online. And it's launching, I think, December 15th. So they have this one, the Daybreak one. Oh, that's the one I wanted, but I can't find. So I might have to order it on Amazon. Um, and one that's a little bit dark, it's like Gilded Day or something like that. This is Twilight Gleam. And I actually, I really like that. And I'm not too crazy about gold highlights, but this one actually works really nice. And I'm actually really happy that I ended up getting it. I know I was like, oh, I don't like it. That's not the one I wanted, but yeah. I wanted to share that with you guys. So let me know what you think. I want your honest opinions, which one you like more. If you don't think it looks good on me, you know, just be like, yeah, you know, I'm not crazy about it on you. So I want to hear your thoughts. And yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys. I'll see you guys in my next video.